Hey guys, the objective of this video is to do an example using Darcy's Law. So, in this question, we would, this is a contraption, maybe something like you'd set up in a lab. You're going to have water flowing through these tubes, through this sample of soil, and out the other end. Okay, and you, we're going to be using this contraption to be able to find K, the proportionality, the coefficient of proportionality of this soil. Okay, so we know Darcy's Law stated that Q equals Ka dh on dl. Okay, so we're just going to find Qa dh on dl and then we can rearrange this equation to get k. So first up, Q. So we've been given that it takes 10 seconds for one centimeter cubed of water to flow through here. So the flow rate is simply going to be one centimeter cubed on 10 seconds, which is 0 0.1 centimeters cubed per second. So there's our flow rate. Now, dH and dL, the hydraulic gradient, okay? So we're going to have to find the head at point A and the head at point B and see the change in head. So the head at point A. So we know head equals Z plus the, the pore water pressure over the gamma of W, over the uh, unit weight of water, right? So before we even start, we have to define a datum. So let's to put our datum at the bottom here. Okay, it's just convenient to do that because we're given all the values going to this base. So, the head at A, it's one meter above the datum, so Z is one, plus, now because this would be constant flow, so this would all be filled with water, we actually develop a pressure of water at A due to the hydrostatic pressure. So because we're two meters below the surface at A, this pressure has